Hey guys, welcome back to another edition of SoCal Sense. I'm Jeff. I'm Luke. And I'm Chelsea. Chelsea, welcome back. <laughs> Thank you. So today we are going to be doing some scents. I posted a picture about two months ago on the community tab that was a leather jacket. And I asked you guys what fragrance you would wear with this leather jacket. And this is what they picked. So here are 10 fragrances that our subscribers picked that they'd wear with a leather jacket. Amazing. Cool. You ready? I am ready. All right. So the first one is um, Dave wrote Bulgari Man in Black. So let us know what you think of Man in Black. Here comes the Man in Black. <laughs> Let's see if it reminds you of Man in Black. <laughs> Ooh, I like this one. I'm trying not to be biased because I do wear Bulgari for women, but it smells nothing like it nothing. at all. <laughs> no, not even close. Um, hmm. Is it like a, like a licorice, a black licorice or something vibe? I don't know, but it's also sweet. No. Like it has a spicy feel to it, like a cinnamon or something. Yeah, I get like a bite, like a spicy, like, now that it's actually settling, yeah, it's like way a spicy, more spicy, boozy type of vibe. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it's good. I like it. Um, could definitely see someone in a leather jacket wearing this. Um, I would rate this, I'm going to go with an 8. Cool. 8 out of 10. That's it. Nice. Yeah, see, I like it. So good one. Yeah, it's good. Um, the next one that you guys suggested was by Stiffmeister1. Stiffmeister1. <laughs> uh, named after the Stiffler. Um, <laughs> Love it. CH Men Prevé. Yeah, Carolina Herrera. Ooh. So let us know what you think of CH Man Privé. <laughs> okay, we shall see. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, this is really good. Super boozy, super leather, right? Oh, and so fresh. Like, in comparison to the other one, it was spice heavy. This is like, oh, just. I can't even nice. say anything other than that. I'm going to go with a nine. 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 Wow. This nice. is really good to me. Yeah. Cool. Cool. And I like that the cap comes attached. It's like a flask. <laughs> it is. That's, yeah. Oh my gosh, cool. Like a flask. Actually, that's awesome. Yeah. Oh. Cool. Nine out of ten for CH Men Privé. Cool. Wow, I love that. Cool. The next one that you guys picked is from Vince Master 100, and he goes, Pure Excess without a doubt. Oh, well, without a doubt. So let's see what you think of Pure Excess. Um, I don't even know if I hit it. I think you did. Okay. I, I don't did. know. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I couldn't even see it. <laughs> I smelled it, though. Yeah, I can smell it a little bit, too. Oh, my gosh, this is good, too. Without a doubt. No, it is really good. Yeah. Um, so this is also a lighter scent. Um... It kind of has like a, oh gosh, I don't even know how to explain it. It's similar in lightness, but it's also like, I don't want to say like aftershave vibe, but it kind of gives me that. Okay. Does it give you vanilla Coke vibes? Is that what it's supposed to give me? That's what it gives a, to me. Really? Like, um, think of like a boozy vanilla Coke. I could smell like a bit of the vanilla in it for sure, no. but... I honestly haven't had a vanilla Coke in God knows how long, so yeah. <laughs> I'm glad you still have still I, keeping the. I don't drink soda, so. <laughs> but um, so it's similar to the other one. I feel like in feel, but it's even a little lighter. I guess a little bubblier. I guess mm. if we're going the Coke route, it feels a little like I don't know. I'm getting like a cloud, like light. Do you like it? I do like it. I'm gonna go a little less than the other one, though. I'm gonna go. Actually, I'm gonna go with an eight for this one. Cool. Right, cool. Eight for pure excess. Wow, these are really different. Like, this is so different from those. Yes. Me. The next one, uh, soccer 90 Tem wrote Tom Ford ombre leather, and then he did the smiley face with the drool coming out. Oh. So he really likes this one. Yeah. He's drooling over this one. So let's let's see. see if we're drooling over this one. Getting the shake. <laughs> yeah. It's in the executive office. Yeah, <laughs> we're super professional here today. Ooh, oh my gosh, so many different leather scents. Okay, obviously this one has like an actual leather like 
scent to it. Um, but it's sweet too. It's like a sweet leather scent and it's not overbearing. Um, definitely as it's settling in though, it's, it's definitely more leather. Um, I'm going to give this one a, I'm going to give this one an eight too. I really like the smell of leather. So nice. okay. I'm going to give this one, but it does smell like leather. Yeah. Yeah. If you don't like leather, it's yeah, not for like, you. <laughs> yeah, it's not. <laughs> cool. Eight out of ten for ombre yeah. leather from Tom Ford. Me and Luke have tried so hard. We've tested it so many times, and every time we've sprayed it on ourselves, we're like, no. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's like you want to smell it, spray it on like a bag. It smells like a like yeah. it's like an old man couch or something. Yeah, it yeah. does. It's, yeah. It, yeah. Would you want to smell that on a person? We're still recording, so. <laughs> Oh, whoa. That's a question. A lot of pressure. Like, oh, it is, like, oh, that is it a, is a nice question. leather smell. I'll agree with yeah. that. But it's like one of those ones where I wear it. It's not for me. A little too heavy all yeah. the time. Yeah, I feel like I wouldn't expect like a person to smell like that unless they're wearing like a leather clothing item. Do you know what Which I mean? Which you'd expect the leather then to yes. smell like that. But I don't know. If so like... let's say like I was wearing like a sweater. You would not want me to wear that. I don't think so. Yeah. I don't think so. So only in a leather jacket, you'd be like, okay. Then it yeah. feels like it makes sense. Otherwise, yeah. you're like, hmm, you know? I don't know. Yeah, I would go. Cool. Yeah, with that. Cool. Awesome. I'm glad we talked about that because I was yeah, like. we needed to get that off our chest. Yeah. The last time we had it on, the person hated it because they're like, it just smells like a car. Why would you want to yeah, wear it, it like a car? The next one that you guys suggested is from Lindsay607. They go, uh, Dior's Fahrenheit. That's the one. Okay, cool. Oh, fair enough. Okay. So, a classic. <laughs> <laughs> Let us know what you think of Fahrenheit. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Um, I like this too. Um, it's so funny how drastically different all of these leather scents are, you know what I mean? Or yeah. to be paired with a leather jacket. Um, Oh gosh, I don't even know how to explain this. You smell either. gasoline. I kind of do. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like as it's settling, yeah. I kind of do. Like, I, I kind of do. That's all I smell when I smell it. Smells it, like it gasoline. smells like yeah. If you you know when you pump gas and then you you pull it out afterwards and maybe like a little bit gets on the ground. Yeah. It's like that, like a little yeah. bit far away, but you know what? Yeah. Exactly. Um, I'm gonna go with a seven. Seven. Okay. Okay. I. I'm so, yeah. like to me. You're being nice with it. Yeah, yeah. you're being nice to it. <laughs> oh, okay. You yeah, what's your so, opinion? Yeah. To seven. I mean, also once it settles, we'll see if it's like even more. Here, we, you want to hear something funny? Yeah. Luke, would you wear this ever? Absolutely not. Yeah. I'm saying. <laughs> I think I think the fact that it's kind of chilly in here though is kind of helping these like fragrances Maybe. smell better than they are. Because <laughs> imagine this like not in like cold weather. Imagine like yeah, we're in a freezing room right yeah, now. Yeah, we are. Icy. Yeah. If we need our. I need my jacket. Yeah. <laughs> Like if it wasn't, yeah, it, like if it's a little touch warm outside. This doesn't not wouldn't. feel like yeah. like a summer day. Or like yeah, but hey, she gave it a seven out of ten for yeah. right now. For so. right now, yeah, let's see, yeah. So we'll wait till see how Fahrenheit does on the dry down. But yeah. you like liked it, didn't love it. Well, how would you I say? Like, it? I feel like initially I liked it, and then as it settles, it definitely gives you more of that gasoline feel to it. So the more you're smelling it right now, the yeah. more it's like I don't love it all that much, but um. Yeah, I like it. I wouldn't so say love. seven on the opening. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Can you imagine Black next tie. year on, I'm like, two? Yeah. Here you go, Luke. Alrighty. Oh. Black tie. The next subscriber choice was by Ryan Ace, and he goes, uh, Black tie, Jeremy Fragrance. Ooh, yay. So you've liked all the other men's yeah. from Jeremy. I do. I think he does a great job. Um, so let us but know what you think of Black Tie. And this is his newest one? Yes. Cool. Those <laughs> <laughs> <was> Luke jokes. <laughs> He's like, it's great. So I got a big whiff. Okay. Um, hmm. You know what, guys? I don't know if I like this one as much as the others. Yeah. It's giving me... Um, it's really strong. It's powerful. Initially. It's yeah. strong. So that I always like tell people, strange. I'm like, like to me, it's very polarizing. This, we... I yeah, it's definitely like a unique scent. Like I feel like I can't compare it to any of the ones that I've smelled. Mm -hmm. mm. With this one in mind too, it's like strictly for a suit and tie. Yeah. 
Yeah. Like, that's why black tie. Yeah, it is. Mm. It's definitely a formal scent. Yeah. Does it have a citrus undertone? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I like it. I'm, I, I, I like it. I'm going to go 7.5, though, for this 7. one. 7.5. Okay. Yeah, I right. don't know. It's it's pretty strong. It's very strong. <laughs> <laughs> the first time we were wearing it in the house when we got it, um, there was like three of us that were wearing it at once. Oh yeah. gosh! And you only need like two sprays on that thing. <laughs> that was, yeah. This yeah. is yeah, it's strong. It well, lasts forever. I was gonna yeah. say. It lasts forever. Yeah. I was gonna say. Good news is like you don't have to reapply. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, you do not. <laughs> you do not. <laughs> cool. cool. So seven point five for uh, black tie. The next subscriber, uh, Lenny Lara, wrote Bentley for Men Intense. Bye bye. <laughs> Wait, did they include that at the end? Yeah. Okay. I was like, is that the name? No. Bye bye. <laughs> it should be, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's smell it. Okay. This gives me like. Um, Definitely, definitely, like an, a more mature man would wear this scent. Yeah, exactly. Um, yep. Business. Um, Teenagers in early twenties. No. I think you should kind of stay away from this yeah. one. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Yeah. It feels like an expensive scent, like a just a a well-to-do mature man. That's what it smells like. It feels like. Um, I guess you could do this like a day in the office, but it feels like maybe more of an evening scent even to me. Yeah. Okay. Um, Picture is like James Bond. Yeah. You know what? Yeah. That's it. That's definitely. A That's kind of how Bond I feel. Vibe. It is a like, James Bond vibe with yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I mean. Shaken, not stirred. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm gonna give this one. I'm gonna go seven point five for this 7. one. Seven point five. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. All right. That's all. Good, but... Bentley intense. Next subscriber says basic or basic because he has a lot of S's in basic uh, goes with black excess. Have I smelled this one before? No, you smell pure excess. Oh, okay, okay, yes. The bottles look shaped the same. Yeah. Yes, they are. Um, here own. we go. Diff completely different smells. Oh wow! Yeah. yeah. I can't fully, um, I'll have, when I go back around and smell that one again, I'll... It's, they smell nothing alike, Wow, so. this one's nice. It's like light, light, yeah. light, light, and fresh, and... Oh my gosh, I like this one. This almost smells like... I'm sorry if I'm... This almost smells like it could be a unisex scent, to be honest. I can see that. It's, it's a fresh, sweet scent. It is. Oh my gosh, yeah. I like it. Strawberry note, right? Yep. It, yeah, it, yeah, it smells like a... a Tart, yeah. sexy strawberry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ooh, I like it, but it's not over the top. No. Really subtle, a daytime scent to me, or a night, or like a beach um, date night. Not like anything. Yeah. Or anything. <laughs> Any like time cool, of the day. Cool all around. Yeah. I like this one. I'm gonna go with an eight for this. Yeah. Okay. I really My picture like is like a rock star scent. Yeah. Do you? Yeah. Like leather jacket coming out of a concert, just walking around. Yeah. Like. Um, Want to smell fresh, like you weren't just sweating. Yeah, on stage. interesting, because nothing smells like that. It doesn't. Yeah. This is very interesting. I like this a lot. Cool. cool. Eight. Cool. All right. The next subscriber go for, is uh, said, and I'm gonna completely butcher your last name. <laughs> it is Hamamansi. Probably, but said your first name. So said goes pure malt. <laughs> pure malt. Pure malt. Get the pure malt leather jacket vibes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Um, we just went back to that like kind of spice. Yeah. Spicy. Um, mm, it's not heavy yet, but it's definitely like, I would say medium to heavy scent. Um, I've smelt, I feel like this, um, cologne or even perfume they all have the same kind of undertone yeah like all of them a lot have of angel yeah have series, the same yeah. it's the same like yeah. spicy feel um not my personal favorite i'm gonna go with a seven seven okay yeah cool, cool. pure mom 
the last one, um, Uncommon Sense Grows, Wanted by Night. And we love Wanted by Night. However, we have featured this a ton on the channel, and it is one of the highest rated fragrances on the channel. And we wanted to do something a little bit new that wasn't out when we posted this picture of the leather jacket. So instead of Wanted by Night, sorry, but we, we have tons of videos with it, we are doing Ferragamo Intense Leather wow. instead. Yeah, it seems to make sense with the name, right? Leather jacket, intense leather. <laughs> Intense leather jacket. Let's see. <laughs> Intense leather jacket. <laughs> it's like super thick. Yeah, right? <laughs> oh, I like this. Okay, this is like a lighter scent, too. Um, like fresh. I like this one a lot, actually. It doesn't, um, it's kind of deceiving in the name, um, at least initially. It doesn't give me like leather vibes at all. Yeah, I. it's... Intense leather is a weird name for it, I yeah. agree. But it's really nice, really fresh. Um, I feel like anybody could wear this. You can't go wrong with this. This is just like, smells like a good scent to just have on hand, yeah. honestly. Um, oh, I really like this. I'm going to go, I'm going to go uh, a nine, I think. Nine. <laughs> nice. So you're really vibing with that one. I like this one. But we'll see once I go through the... Yeah, I like it too because it's it's like fresh. It is. It's really fresh. Really fresh. I feel like you could spray it anytime. Like for a date, you could spray it during the day. I mean, literally anytime. It's so versatile. Yes, it is. Cool. cool. Yummy. So those are 10. Cool. We're going to go back through the dry down. She's going to let us know what she likes better, worse, or the same. And then we'll find out what was her actual favorite. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> awesome. So we are back, and we are going to have Chelsea rate the dry downs. Let us know if she likes it better, uh, worse, or if they stay the same. Cool. First one is uh, Man in Black. Um, let's see. Oh, wow. This is really, like, less it linked in. Um, it's not as potent. Um... And maybe a little bit more. Okay. Maybe a little bit more, but like half point more. So would that make it? I don't remember what you scored it. I don't that was a long time ago. <laughs> but yeah, that was in the very beginning. <laughs> um, so a little bit better. Yeah, a little bit better. Cool. All right. Uh, let's go. I don't remember the order. Let me do it. <laughs> CH Med Privé. <laughs> we're making it up as we go. We didn't have them in order when we were doing them, yeah. so. Oh, wow. This one's definitely less than two. Um, as far as like potency, I feel like, but I still love it. I still really love this one. Um, I'm going to go, I guess a little more actually. Yeah, I'm going. This is a nine. More. Yeah. So, we're going a little more. Okay. Okay. So like, like nine, five, like in 9.75, 9.75. You really like this one. <laughs> okay. I really like Chelsea's it. vibing with <laughs> CH men and All righty. All right. Uh, uh, let's just say here, let's go black tie. Why not? This is probably not the order, but. <laughs> it might be. It doesn't matter anymore. Yeah, <laughs> we're wild over here. Ooh, I actually like this one better. Now that it's been sitting for a second. Um, I don't remember what I did, but definitely more. Enjoyable? I, yeah, more, a little more enjoyable. I've... Hey guys, so we were filming the dry downs. We filmed all of the dry downs. We did. And then the camera cut off during the dry downs. So <laughs> I'll... Sh I'll edit this in after the first part of the dry downs that you were talking about, um, but we're just gonna we're just gonna summarize these. Yes. So let's start with like Fahrenheit. Got worse for you, right? It did. And um, this is one you would not prefer on a guy. Nope, would prefer it on a car. <laughs> Spilling out of the gasoline. Yes. Yes. Cool. Where and it belongs. Bentley Intense was an older gentleman fragrance that, again, you wouldn't mind not smelling again. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Cool. And the other one you would not mind smelling again was... We're so polite about it. like Was pure malt. Yeah, no, I definitely wouldn't. So it got worse on the dry down. Yeah, I just it's, it's strong and spicy and just not my personal fate. Okay. Um, ombre leather, what do you think of ombre leather? Um, the Tom Ford? Yes. Uh, I like it if you want to smell like leather. Like, same thing across the board. If you're wearing a leather item, it works. If you're not, a little weird me but i do like it i like the smell of leather cool so 
the rest of them they got a little bit better for you yeah there's a lot of really good so ones. we'll quickly go over that one okay. real quick uh, man in black okay wait we have that on there i'm like we don't need to do man in black i was like that's one of the ones that stayed on there uh let's go take it away, take it away. here's pure excess <laughs> yeah this one's great this one's great too um I was saying that, I mean, I think this one... You gave it a little bit better. Yeah, than I, was, we I was going to say, then let's stay with a little bit better. And it's cool. still great. <laughs> um, Ferragamo Intense Leather. Yes. You this guys one, should have seen the original Dragon. I know, it was, it was awesome. wild. I know. <laughs> <laughs> um, this one's great, too. Yeah. This is like a solid, great scent. Uh, Black Excess. Okay. Love this one. Love, love, love this one. Cool. Um, so it did get better for you. Yes, that one got better. Yeah, these two. And then Seishman Privé got better as well. Yeah, it did. Yeah, this is so good. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I love these two. Cool. Yeah. Scents. So her two favorites. Well, what do you think of Black Tie? Oh. oh yes, Black Tie. So Black Tie on the dry down. Yes. I think it's better. I think it's better. A little bit better on the dry down. Yes. Cool. Cool. Yay! And then, so her two favorites, so we're just skipping her comparing all of them, because she already compared all of them. I did. <laughs> uh, she tied mm -hmm. uh, C.H. Men Privé and Black Excess. I couldn't choose, and they're both so good and so different, so. Couldn't even be remotely yeah, the same. Yeah, they're really, they're so great. And then third was uh, Intense Leather. And fourth was Pure Excess. Having said that, she loved both of these. I two. love both of them. Like honestly, I would tie those as well. So really, no. we only have a first and second. Place. <laughs> only a first and second. And between your top four, uh -huh. they are so drastically different I from know. each other. Yeah. Um, That's what made it difficult. Yeah. Choose. Yeah. And then you also liked you liked Men in Black. I did. Um, you liked? Did you like Black Tie? What are your thoughts I did. on Black Tie? I liked it better now. Now that it's um, not so strong, it kind of sat for a second, and it's. I think better, yes. Cool, a little cool. bit better, yeah. And then uh, your thoughts, ombre leather, You only if they were wearing a leather jacket. Yes. Yeah. Not in a leather jacket, you would rather not smell it. Yeah, yeah. or like on a leather bag or something. Yeah. <laughs> cool, cool. Uh, thank you, Chelsea. Thank you for having me. Yay. Um, be sure to follow us down below. You should. You should definitely follow you should us. Do it. Just do it. And then, uh, hey Luke, how's the music coming? It's good. New music on the way. New music uh, that was released last week. Go check it out. <laughs> Yay. My grammar was weird there, but you know what I mean. All right. Spotify, Spotify, Apple Spotify. Music. Yes, yes. All the go. things. Pretty, yeah. pretty much everywhere you can stream music. Stream yes. Luke Baker music. Yes. Um, and yeah, cool. Yay. Bye, guys. Bye.